do do a lot of sanding and polishing paint finishes. Let me show you a few products that are gonna make your life a whole lot easier. So last year we came out with our adhesive back wet sandpaper. These are 40 foot rolls of wet sandpaper that we generally like to use when we are cutting and polishing clear. Uh, this type of paper, being that it's a roll, can be put on any type of block that accepts sticky paper, but uh, we use them a lot on, on the linear blocks, and then we also have a detail, wet sand detail set that is five different blocks. This is a few of them that we're gonna use on these demon parts, but that is five separate blocks from three inches up to 24 inches that work well with this wet sand paper. So if you're going for laser straight reflections, you want to use a long block to block clear. Well, sometimes that's a problem because a lot of the wet sandpaper is limited to 10 inches or 11 and a half inches, and a lot of it's not sticky. So you're stuck to using a foam block or a rubber block and trying to hold it on there. This is an excellent solution to that. So I'm gonna block this door with an 18 inch flex linear block, just like we did before we painted this. So now I can take this wet sandpaper and use the same block that I blocked this with during body work and, and paint prep and cut my clear with the same block that I used. Or I could use one of the blocks from our wet sand detail kit. This is a 24 inch wet sanding block. It's a little, uh, little lighter, a little more comfortable for wet sanding in my opinion. And the paper doesn't leave any residue behind on this specific type of plastic that we use for these blocks. They are somewhat flexible, mostly rigid, but somewhat flexible. There's no sharp edges on these blocks. There is, they're all radius corners and rounded edges. So you're not digging in anywhere when you're, when you're blocking clear, especially when you're blocking clear. 